write down the numerical calculate the wavelength of tennis ball of mass Sixty grams moving with the velocity of ten meter per second. okay so what is given the mass which is given in the 60 gram so first you will convert into the uh, kilograms means mass 60 divided by 1000 it will be in the kilograms okay and what does heisenberg uh, sorry de broglie state lambda h over mv so now you are given with the H that is the constant mass and the velocity. Put the values and find out. Hurry up. Till then I am writing the other numerical. So mass you will take this. V is given to you. That is. Ten meter second, meter per second. We will continue doing it, and I am writing the other numerical then. So, Riddhi is writing the answer. Yes, Riddhi, you are absolutely right. Your answer must be one point one zero four into ten to the power minus thirty three. Now in the next numerical, calculate the uncertainty in the position of the dust of the dust particle with the mass equal to with the mass equal to it is given one mg. पहले मैं कन्वर्ट कर दू मास इज इक्वल टू वन एम जी मीन्स टेन जस्टी पावर माइनस सिक्स किलोग्राम इफ द in velocity is 5.5 into 10 which the power minus 20 meter per second now h value you know h is 6.626 into 10 which the power minus 34 
Now in the particular numerical, you have to find uncertainty in the position and you are given with the mass, you are given with the velocity. Okay? So how you will do it? Yes, delta M, delta X, that is uncertainty in the position, okay? And delta V, that is uncertainty in the velocity, is H over 4 pi M. M is a mass. Yav kade delta x into delta p is equal to h over 4 pi. Take a bit. Agar delta p ko humne change liya to delta x is equal to multiply by delta v into m is equal to 4 pi. Or ye wala m aap nichi le. Equation ye a gya. Now in this equation, we have to remove uncertainty in the position. Means you have to find this one. This you are given with, this you are given with, pi ki value you have to know about pi, and m you are given with. Hurry up, find out. H will be 6.626 into 10 is minus 34. 4 multiplied by 10 raised to the power minus 6 for the mass. And what is pi? Pi 3.14. Hurry up. And you done? Yes. Yes, no one has given the answer yet. We take this in this army, give it that. Delta M, uh, when you delta M, yoga, mass doesn't change. Momentum may velocity change. Hoti hai. Delta M will be not there. It is only M. Yes. 
Okay, okay. No problem. Today you have uh, the revision test also. So your answer must be 9.59 into 10 raised to the power minus 10. Okay. So the next question I am writing and if you are getting the same value, then your answer is right. Now one of the numerical pronunciation are the base. Our timing is the same. Will I share by 7.30 or 7 o'clock? I'll tell you. Write down it is NCRT based only. What is the wavelength of light emitted when the electron? in a hydrogen atom undergoes transition from an energy level with n is equal to 4 to an energy level n is equal to 2. So they are asking you to find the wavelength. Okay. So what we what is the formula that is wave number? We are finding with the help of wave number one upon lambda. Wave number is equal to one upon lambda. Okay, Japan Jodh will send at 7:30. Is equal to R one. Now, what is the value of R? R is Now, what is the value of N1? N1 is given to us is 2 and N2 is given to us it is 4. Hurry up. Now, to put the values and find out. Put the values and find out. Hurry up, bitte. So many numericals are there. We don't have much of the time. Now I will take over empirical formula of the first chapter. Hurry up.
ओके मैं तब तक नेक्स्ट नोमेरिकल लिख रही हूँ बेटे यू कैरी ऑन विद दिस एंड टेल मी योर आंसर द वैल्यूज आई हैव टोल्ड यू हाँ बस यूर आंसर इज वेरी मच राइट रिद्धि बट दे शुड नॉट बी अ डेसीमल जस्ट की डाउट यूर यूर रॉन्ग इट इज फोर एटी सिक्स नैनोमीटर नैनोमीटर यू हैव टू फाइंड द वेब लेंथ इन नैनोमीटर बेटे If it is centimeter, then it is four eighty six into ten raised to the power minus seven centimeter. Manan, your answer is so. I don't know, son. What is it? Just check it out. We are here wrong. Now next question. Look, son. Chapter one. We see in parallel formula. We see a question. Come, come, come. Okay. So, let's see. An organometallic compound or analysis was found to contain. What it is containing carbon, hydrogen and iron. ठीक. So, कितना percent carbon है? It is sixty four point four. कितनी hydrogen है? That is five point five zero. And कितनी iron है? That is twenty nine point nine. ठीक. Now atomic mass. No carbon has twelve atomic mass, hydrogen has one, and it is fifty-six. Now you will find number of moles. Hurry up. So number of moles we know that is given mass over molar mass. So what is the value you are getting? Hurry up. Hurry up. Find out the values you are getting. हरिया भरिया नंबर ऑफ मोल्स कितने कितने आए सो इन द फर्स्ट नंबर ऑफ मोल्स विल बी विजिबल Five point three six. Yes, the number of moles will be five point three six, and in the second number of moles will be five point five zero, and the third one is zero point five three. Now, after finding the number of moles, simpler molar ratio you have to find out. Simpler molar ratio. How you will find out that ratio? 
by dividing with the least number of moles. So the least is zero point five three. That is. So what is the value here? You will be getting here. You will be getting ten point one, ten point four, and here it is one. Now to convert into the simple whole number ratio, we can say it is ten. It is ten, and it is one. So what will be the empirical formula? E ten H ten. Okay. So one more question of this type. Do the next question. Sun will take it easy. कुछ भी नहीं किया. चलो बेटे एक और क्वेश्चन कर लो ऐसा एंड देन वी विल डू द नेक्स्ट वन ऑफ कॉन्सेंट्रेशन द सैंपल ऑफ सॉल्ट एज अ फॉलोइंग परसेंटेज कॉम्पोजिशन Now the salt has following percentage composition. That is iron, sulfur, and oxygen. Iron is thirty six point seven six. Sulfur is twenty one point one one, and forty two point one two. So what is the molecular mass of iron? You have done or atomic mass of iron? You have done now only. Hurry up. Fifty-six. Fifty-six. So, what is the atomic mass of sulfur? Thirty-two. How much? Thirty-two. Thirty-two. What is the atomic mass of oxygen? Sixteen. Sixteen. Find out the number of moles. Given mass. Four molar mass. Hurry up! What is the value you are getting? Hurry up, bitte. Here it must be one one. Here, bitte, one one one. and so we are left with only 2 minutes hurry up bitte so you will be getting 0.65 0.64 and 2.63 this should be your number of moles now divide it by least क्या लिस्ट है जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स फोर वी विल डिवाइड विद जीरो पॉइंट सिक्स फोर ईयर वन ईयर वन ईयर Even point five is four is so me banana. That is four. 
So your empirical formula will be. Ma'am, F E S O four. So now I am taking one molarity based question. I don't. So here you are given with the molarity of a solution of sulfuric acid, and you have to find the molarity. ठीक है बेटे? तो molarity क्या होता है? First of all, you should know what is molarity. Molarity is number of yes what is molarity ma'am number of moles of solute divided by the mass of solvent in kg mass of solvent in kg and what is molarity Mom, number of moles of solute divided by the volume in liter. This is volume of solution. It is mass of solvent. Okay, but this is the difference between molarity and molarity. Now, mass of solution. We can get out. Mass of solution. How can we get out? हमें गिवन क्या है वी आर गिवन मास ऑफ सॉल्यूशन क्या पहले तो बताओ मास ऑफ सॉल्यूशन व्हाट इज डेंसिटी डेंसिटी इज इक्वल टू मास ओवर वॉल्यूम तो व्हाट इज मास ऑफ सॉल्यूशन वॉल्यूम इनटू डेंसिटी सो इट विल बी वॉल्यूम ऑफ सॉल्यूशन इनटू डेंसिटी of solution okay now what is mass of a solute mass of a solute kaise nikal loge you have done the practicals wo kya hoga molarity into molar mass molarity into मोलर मास निकालते हो स्ट्रेंथ सो मोलैरिटी यू आर गिवन विद दैट इज वन पॉइंट थ्री फाइव एंड मोलर मास इज नाइंटी एट ओके बेटे इससे आपको मास ऑफ सोल्यूट आ जाएगा और मास ऑफ सोल्यूशन
from the molarity concentration you will can be obtained okay that will be uh, 10 20 and we'll do continue with uh, this numerical tomorrow as a mm -hmm.